Hi, my name is Rachel Ungerer, and I am a queer disabled artist, and I'm from the Bay. I make a lot of paintings about intimacy and human connection, and a lot of that is also centered around my identities and the way they intersect. I have an invisible disability, and it's a really big part of my life, whether I like it or not. So I try to kind of share what that life is like as well, since before I was disabled, I had no idea what that was like. I didn't know about the societal oppressions, and I also didn't know about the way people can care for each other and be really loving. So I'm trying to show both the good and the bad in my art and just be really honest about what that life is like. I had to reteach myself how to paint after I became disabled. I have a chronic pain condition in both of my hands that I've had for 12 years, and they are in constant pain all the time. Every time I use my hands, they hurt. So I learned that if I paint really, really quickly and take very long breaks in between, that I can still paint. My art is about a lot of different things. So there's art that's really focused on disability and there's art that's focused on intimacy as a broader concept between people. And there's also much more kinky art um, and queerness is just all up in all of it. Um, and that all those things intersect in every piece with both the disabled art and the sensual art. I try to think about vulnerability and in our society, vulnerability isn't often seen as a good thing. And instead it can be really actually very empowering and beautiful and allow for this level of connection that we don't always accept in our lives and we can get deeper with people when we're vulnerable. And I try to, my art's very vulnerable. People learn way too much about me by learning my art. So I try to have the characters in my art show that as well. This is a drawing of someone who was tied and suspended and now is getting untied and is pretty blissed out. So I just wanted to paint that and make some kinky art, honestly. I'm really excited to be part of this show and I love that Synesthesia is putting it on. Um, I love the idea of disability being highlighted through art because it doesn't often happen. We don't think of disability in society as a way to be empowered. And I love that Synesthesia is doing that and in like giving space for disabled voices. Uh -huh.